Isaiah 53 verse 1 and John 1 verses 10 to 11, the rejected and despised. In the sacred tapestry of Scripture, prophecy and fulfillment converge to illuminate the painful reality of rejection and despisal. Isaiah 53 verse 1 and John 1 verses 10 to 11 are two threads that intertwine, revealing the profound significance of Jesus being rejected and despised by his own people. This essay embarks on a journey through these verses, exploring their harmonious narrative and the timeless teachings they convey. Isaiah 53 verse 1 A Prophetic Prediction In the prophetic verses, Isaiah 53 verse 1 predicts the rejection and despisal of the coming Messiah. Who has believed our message and to whom has the arm of the Lord been revealed? These words in Isaiah 53 verse 1 anticipate a reality where the message of the Messiah would be met with disbelief and skepticism. The prophecy foreshadows a heart-wrenching rejection and a sense of isolation that the Messiah would endure. John 1 verses 10 to 11 The Fulfillment Revealed Transition to the New Testament, where the Gospel of John unveils the fulfillment in John 1 verses 10 to 11. He was in the world, and though the world was made through him, the world did not recognize him. He came to that which was his own, but his own did not receive him. In these verses, the fulfillment of Isaiah's prediction comes to fruition as John describes Jesus' entrance into the world and the response he received from his own people. The convergence of prophecy and reality marks a moment of profound recognition and sorrow. The rejected and despised prophecy and fulfillment aligned. Isaiah 53 verse 1 and John 1 verses 10 to 11 weave a narrative that bridges prophecy and fulfillment, encapsulating the painful reality of Jesus' rejection and despisal. Timeless Teachings and Daily Relevance Unexpected Response The fulfillment of Isaiah's prophecy underscores the unexpected response to Jesus. We're called to reflect on how familiarity can sometimes lead to disbelief. Human Resistance The prophecy speaks of human resistance to divine truth. We're encouraged to examine our own hearts for any signs of rejecting Jesus. Suffering Savior The fulfillment reveals Jesus as the suffering Savior. We're prompted to find solace in his understanding of rejection and to bring our own hurts to him. Divine Perspective The concept of rejection and despisal challenges us to adopt a divine perspective. We're reminded of the importance of seeing beyond appearances. Unwavering love, the prophecy and fulfillment inspire us to grasp Jesus' unwavering love. We're invited to embrace his acceptance of us despite our flaws. In conclusion, Isaiah 53 verse 1 and John 1 verses 10 to 11 stand as an intertwined portrayal of Jesus' rejection and despisal, bridging prophecy and fulfillment. Through these verses, we gain insights into the unexpected response to Jesus, the human tendency to resist divine truth his role as a suffering savior, the call to adopt a divine perspective, and the power of his unwavering love. As we navigate life's challenges, may these verses guide us to embrace the transformative power of understanding Jesus' experience of rejection, inspiring us to open our hearts to him, accept his love, and extend his acceptance to others.